What we've tried to do with Wales and West is to produce a concept vehicle to deploy hydrogen vehicle technology to the benefit of, of society in South Wales. The use of hydrogen in vehicles is exciting because it provides an alternative to battery electric. We know that we're going to have to move our fleet to zero emissions over the next few years, and the earlier we can start, the better. Battery electric vehicles aren't for everybody, so we're very keen to trial a hydrogen vehicle which can have a longer range, can be refuelled in a very similar time to diesel, and doesn't suffer any range degradation issues during cold weather. We're going to use it as a first call operatives vehicle, which for us is a critical frontline vehicle role, visiting customers and attending public reported gas escapes. What we've done is, is bring our demonstration trials to South Wales. And because there's no fixed refueling here, hydrogen refueling, we've partnered with Proteum and Hippo to create a what we call a hydrogen vehicle ecosystem. Uh, where we're providing the, the, the vehicles, Wales and West are using them, and Proteum have developed and, and produced the green hydrogen that Hippo can use to put in the tanks. You've got this real kind of nucleus here of a supply chain, which is deploying today onto the roads, and they can just grow. So I just see this area as being a real hotspot for the hydrogen economy, and with that will come more and more jobs. Our expectations at the end of the trial is we'll be able to demonstrate to, to drivers and to fleet managers, fleet operators, how hydrogen is to live with. Our expectation is people will find that the driving experience is very, very similar to normal regular vehicles, if not maybe slightly better. We'll find that people realise that hydrogen is safe to use and it isn't that difficult to perform as a, as a refuelling process. So we're really keen to try this and to get some operating experience, some real data, and to then start to compare that data in terms of data we might gather in terms of battery electric vehicles and then compare it with our existing diesel fleet. There's no doubt that battery electric vehicles form part of the, the future deployment in fleets, but there are many fleet operators in the UK and globally that are starting to realise that there are certain duty cycles, ways that vans are being used, that require better range, higher payload, faster refueling, and that's where our hydrogen fuel cell vans hit the spot.